long. That is definitely one that's a little long, though. Uh, that's, I mean, that's a good 25. That's a Golden Frieza type one, huh? Um, okay, so. Uh, oh, okay, okay. Goku, Trunks, and Vegeta. Yeah, we got the boys. We got the squad right here. All right, so let's go ahead and take a look at how good they are. This is the newest Carnival LR. Um, they, of course, are a 200% leader to Super Saiyan. Um, some of the important things to just mention really quick are we do need a couple of Super Saiyan category characters. Shouldn't be the hardest. There are some monsters in the game. Um, you know, we have Sword of Hope Trunks. We have LR Future Gohan, right? Uh, we do have, you know, maybe like Age LR Gohan if you're fighting Omega. You know, th there's a couple of Super Saiyan characters that could be good. Obviously, Dokkan, Prescott, Goku as well. Um, now, the big thing we should take a look at here is orbs. So, Goku and Vegeta... They get an additional that has a high chance to be a super for every three key spheres obtained. We load it into six right here, right? So that means that, again, we could go ahead and get um, a bunch. I guess I could... I I'm, I'm just going to do this for now. Um, we could put them in the middle spot, and we could do a little... How much better in terms of links? Oh, quite a bit better. Um... But I, I think I'm just going to do this. We'll, we'll see really crazy damage next turn anyway. So that does get them the 24 key. Okay, perfect. All right, let's see how they do. Um, Goku, Vegeta, and Trunks. Keep in mind that uh, for the first five turns with their intro, we are super effective against all types. They do have 30% damage reduction. They should eat this well. They're essentially guarding with damage reduction right there, so it shouldn't be too bad. Yeah, pretty good. All right, let's see. What do we get right here? Uh, so remember, we could potentially super four times. 11? Okay. Uh, now keep in mind that their super attack effect, 18 key right here, is very powerful. 50% attack units for three turns. Every additional super we get is 50% attack for three turns. So um, I think that, again, I, I say this a lot. Damage, a lot of the times, is not nearly as impactful as people like to make it out to be. As long as you're able to kind of, like, parry the boss, like, big attacks, you should be good. But it is important to understand that there is a difference between damage and damage. And these boys can do damage, right? Because, it, it, I mean, some of it could be RNG. Because every additional super that they get, every additional that they get from their orb mechanic... Um, is a high chance to be a super. Now, I typically don't really have great luck with that, but there's going to be those that do have great luck with that, right? Getting the additional supers, which should do just, again, utterly massive amounts of damage. Um, I, I I mean, I don't know. I, I, I think that they they should be quite good. Uh, damn. Okay, we... we okay, okay. This is not a great rotation, we have a couple of characters who could go slot one, but uh, we might not have found them here. Oh my god. All right, here, hold on. Let's... Okay, we're in trouble. We're in trouble. We got a very clunky opening rotation here. Uh-oh. Here, let, let, let's go for Zamasu right here. Um, Spirit Bomb Absorb Goku, we're going to need to hit this right here. Perfect. All right, we might actually be going out on this this rotate. Like, if Rosé supers right away, we're in a little bit of trouble here, potentially. Okay, perfect. We should be good. We should be good. A little scary. A little scary. Yeah, that, that's a bit of a clunky rotation we got right there. No Bulma, no God Goku to man down those slot one. Could be a little bit risky there. Um. Okay, okay. Is, is there anything major to talk about Goku and Vegeta before we get to this next turn? Now, uh, one thing to understand, again, everyone needs to understand... That what we're about to see from them on this next turn is potentially going to be very crazy. Because we had a bunch of super attacks. The 50% attack, 50% attack, 50% attack. Again, that's for three turns. So, we could be looking very good. Damn, Rosé, that's... I, they took that much? Every time I come into the stage, it's a disaster. These two bastards dropping supers. You know, one thing that the Dismal Future Red Zone, like, a mistake it made is that it's kind of, like, a very similar. For, like, fight two, three, and four are very similar, right? Th that Goku Black and Zamasu stage, they really should have had it to where it was Goku Black and Zamasu as separate enemies like this. Like, if it was, like, this stage, 
but both of these boys were, you know, dishing out the 1.4 million damage super attack or something like that, that would be a scary as hell fight. There's, I, I mean, what what is a fight like that? The Gammas? I, I'm kind of going on a little bit of a tangent. Oh, they're fine. Okay, phew. I, I was nervous that Spirit Palms from Goku might get hit, but we're, we're fine, we're fine. Uh, how much how much damage do the Gammas do? Let me, let me double check that. Because that would have been a much better fight than just kind of like the tech Goku Black and Zamasu that you fight at the end, who are... You know, it's just like the 50th, you know, consecutive boss, basically. Um, yeah, I want to see what uh, Super Attack the Gammas do at the end. Like, what their damage is. The Gammas... Yeah, they only do 1.2. That's, like, that's nothing, right? 1.2 is what they do in the last phase. Like, you know, if we had Goku Black and Zamasu and they were at, like, 1.5... <sighs> that could be... That could be something... Something else. Okay. Oh, 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 oh. Uh, fellas, <laughs> wait a minute, hang on, hang on, hang on. Now, we do have uh, a little negative moment right here. Sure, it would be nice if they created their orbs. So, what do they get right here? So, they get an additional three key per in key sphere obtained. Okay, cool. They randomly change key spheres of a certain type to int. If there's another Super Saiyan or Movie Hero category ally in the same turn, which we've got. Thank you for the... Thanks. Actually, God Goku didn't do very much either. There's the power of type orb changing and how it really can bite you in the ass. Um, okay, I, I do want to make sure to get God Goku in slot one, get him his orbs. What do we got right here? That's six. I guess that's still acceptable. Well, not really. Look at the key. Huh. What, what is our defense right here? 381. Mm. Man, they, they struggle for key that much, huh? I mean, it's not like we don't have, like, you know, decent links here. You know, we have Pure Saiyan, we have uh, Prepare for Battle, and we have Fierce Battle. Uh, I mean, they have, what, Super Saiyan, Golden Warrior, Saiyan Warrior Race, Experienced Fighters, Prepare for Battle, Fierce Battle, Legendary Power. I mean, this is not good. Right here, okay. Uh, they didn't create any in orbs that kind of bit us in the ass a little bit. We'll get a little bit more key and stats and stuff right there. Mm -hmm. uh, I mean, that's certainly a concern. I mean, they have a tendency to potentially fail in a big moment, but that doesn't really impact their defense, huh? As long as you can get the ET, like all, all the extra bells and whistles are gonna get with a bunch of orbs and stuff like that, that's going to be uh, additionals that they get, right? They're not getting defense from 12 key super attacks, only from their 18 key. So as long as you hit that, you're going to get the 130% attack and defense when attacking, and you're also going to be able to get the um, uh, defense, what should we call it, uh, uh, from the 18 key. Damn, I can't... Bro, both God Goku and them failed at the exact same moment. Ain't that crazy? All right, what do we get right here? This should be good. Yeah, 15. Remember, we still could get a little bit higher, too. Um, you know, well, I mean, if we had an extra, what, four key or whatever. So there's that. Hopefully we get good luck with additional supers and they can do a lot of damage right here. All right, normal, sure. Remember, they are super effective against all types. Here's an additional super right here. Uh, we still could do, what, one more? They still have the hidden potential system additional, uh, ready to go. At max, they could do five supers. And every super attack that they do, do, yep, there's another one. I mean, that's going to be a lot of additional damage. Dude, it's... Oh, my God. It's so much... Like, we're used to that shot of Blue Goku and Vegeta, and it's like a 2 billion attack stat. And then these boys are coming out, and it's a, it's 11. Like, okay, thanks, fellas, for the, the 11 right there. I mean, that's a little bit better than the 2s. That the, the Blues... The Blues... Uh, all right, nice. 2 billion attack stat, fellas. <laughs> all right, back on to another rotation. Uh, we had a little bit of uh, an accident there. All right, let, let's see how we do in this rotation. Um, so we do create a lot of orbs, mostly the physical ones for God Goku, but I mean, this could still be a decent rotation for them. Let's do this, uh, and then we could get, I mean, again, a full round of orbs for them right here. This is 17 orbs? Okay, sure. So we got 17 orbs with them. This is good. We got a lot of links up and stuff like that. Everything except for, what is that, experienced fighters? No, that's Golden Warrior, actually. Yeah, that's Golden Warrior, which doesn't do anything. Um, okay, I, I want to get, like, this rotation and then maybe one more. I mean, I, I feel like we do see what they do. I mean, remember, they have 30% damage reduction right here. They feel to me like probably, like, a bit of a better sort of Hope Trunks. It's like, I think that they're better at the start, but then Trunks is better, obviously, once you do his standby. 
I mean, he's, you know, he, he's going to be crazy. But this Goku, Vegeta, and Trunks, the damage they deal is going to be outrageous. Especially when we get to their active skill turn. I think that their active skill, it depends on how many, like, additional supers we get. But, like, if we get a bunch of additional supers leading into their active, their active is going to be nutsy. Okay. I mean, this is something that could happen. Additional, normal, additional, normal, additional, normal, additional, normal. Damn. Well, I mean, that's... <laughs> um, well, that, uh, I, 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 well, uh, you know, <laughs> all right, let's see, um, I mean, certainly, uh, we've had a couple of rotations here where this type orb changing is not really doing very much for us, huh, uh, that is going to be a bit of an issue, I mean, look at this, look how clunky this is, hmm, yeah, I mean, we we definitely could encounter some real problems here. The 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 int orb changing, uh, I like like this this certainly would be an issue. Like like running like God Goku with them. Um, okay, okay, that, that that's that's gonna be a bit of a problem, right? We're gonna actually need orbs. I guess my, my luck today is not really going so fire. We can say that God Goku will be okay here, even if he doesn't, uh, which he didn't. All right, um, I, I want to get to a turn where we do the active, but, I mean, I, I guess I'm not really going to fish for them to get, like, 50 uh, additional supers or anything like that. Like, if we get them, we get them. If we don't, we don't. It's it's whatever, right? Um, but if we're going to do a ton of additional supers before they actually get their um, active off, like, it, it's going to do so much damage. And remember, they're, like, guaranteed critting and stuff like that during the turn, too, so could be very impressive their damage is always going to be good though because remember all these attacks they're doing are all always super effective against all types okay additional normal there we go there's there you go fellas my god <laughs> please please we, we got to get the additional supers uh, okay i mean i in my experience sort of hope trunks like can do some stuff so uh, I know that they will be able to, too, as well, right? Um, all right, let, let's get the uh, the active turn out. We need to see that. All right, here we go. So, uh, we have a full Super Saiyan rotation, which means we are going to have the good stuff, which, of course, is their active. So, uh, remember that their active condition is actually very, very good, right? We're able to do this if the entire rotation is Super Saiyan, starting from turn three, or if it's just turn six. Um, a lot of good characters have started to have um, conditions like that. Now, after we do this active, they're gonna massively raise attack temporarily, do ultimate damage to the enemy, and then within this turn, all attacks are gonna be guaranteed crits. So um, let's go ahead and fire off the active skill right here. That's a lot of damage right there, considering we didn't even go super crazy with the additional supers. That, dude, that shit is going to hit so hard. They're active. It, it's it's going to be one of the, the most impressive things in the game, I'm thinking. They're active. It, it, it's going to be super nuts. Um. Okay, okay, okay. So we had that. That's good. Let's go ahead and hit this for God Goku. Uh, I believe we have all seven links activated next to Spirit Bomb Reserve Goku, which is going to be good. Um, we'll be able to get, um, a couple of additionals. Let's see, we would need nine orbs in order to get their full additionals. So, we could just go ahead and hit, uh, this right here. By the way, look at the difference with int key, right? These eight orbs get us a 23 key, but then just this six with a couple of ints are gonna get us that. So, that's, that's, that's perfect right there, sure. Alright, let's see, uh, the damage that we're doing here. Now, remember, on this turn, they're doing guaranteed crits for the full turn. They have one of these really mega good active skills right here. 
Um, so using this character, I mean, I, I think that this is going to be another character where rainbow orb changing is going to be very important. Um, their type, type orb changing can be a little bit iffy if we're not talking about a slot one character, which is kind of one of, like, the biggest things about that, right? Um, it, it's like God Goku oftentimes can get away with it, um, with all the defensive ability, but we'll see with the Goku, uh, Trunks and Vegeta. All right, so what are we at in terms of damage here? 18.3. Um, we're doing guaranteed crit, and we could do three more additionals after this right here. Okay, there's one. There's a second. Okay. Now, keep in mind, this is after they did the billion damage crit on the, the active as well. Uh, dude, like, Omega, Zamat, like, if you get this against any of those dudes... And then you get a nice round of, like, supers. Like, they're they're taking, like, all those bosses down. That active skill, I'm telling y'all, it is going to be borderline a win button. It, it's, it's like, if, if you set it up, if you could set it up correctly, and, of course, with a bit of good RNG, because, you know, the additional supers do a lot for them, you could set it up right. They, they could be crazy. They're good. This is definitely a strong top 10 contender to me. Um, I, I, this is a unit, I think, as I use more, I'm going to come to like them. Um, like, Sword of Hope. Um, they, they, unlike Sword of Hope, though, they do have some restrictions, but I don't think that the Super Saiyan or Movie Hero right now, I don't think that that's necessarily that bad. I think that they're a pretty good character. Um, and again, once Goku drops that active skill Spirit Bomb Azor, it's gonna be real crazy. Let me know what you guys think of them, but this is a very, very strong character.